Hi friends, this is Trivial. Now I uh, now I will teach match two tables and display the records into data grid view. Okay. So I I want to match two tables. So I have a database. Uh, my database name is uh, student. Okay. I have a n number of database n number of databases. So I want to match two tables and uh, that result I want to show in my data grid view. Okay. So I want to match two tables. So first I uh, I match two tables. So I am using the this is data server explorer. Uh, you didn't see server explorer. You have to go to view and server explorer here. So here you have to connect your database. Then just click connect database. Now one window will be come here. You have to change option. You have directly connect to into your databases database server. Then you have to use. Uh, Microsoft SQL Microsoft SQL server otherwise you have, you have you, you using SQL server data file da, example md dot mdf file okay then you have to choose here you have to da, odbc database then you have to choose here other databases and the oracle database then you have to choose here I'm you uh, I'm okay like that you have to choose uh, SQL server and just put dot and finding your databases here student databases so I already attached a student database here so I'm using that database okay mm. so I have the two tables uh, so just right click new query new query is the uh, query window to you have to execute your SQL query here and you perfectly is working then you have to copy the code and use it in your programs so I am telling you the easy ways to, way to understand your programs so I am using I want to add two tables okay uh, first I had uh, like uh, uh, class info and then student info okay I have two tables so just I am just I'm selecting all here all and execute we getting a result like that so this is the result so I am merging two tables so I want need some fields only so I am using academic year class and student ID student name and data work I merge two tables and execute here I'm getting results like that 28 results is that so okay just I am copy this code control C or right click on to copy so now I am going to programs first time add some data grid view here data grid view here so I am using click delete in a, in a D, D check uh, delete, enable deleting enable editing and enable adding okay now I am using one button here so once I hit the button the query will be executed like that okay so by look I am changing the property color back color equal to active okay. so here I am changing the button properties name property name equal to Mm, like uh, show show once hit the button the button click event is triggered okay now I'm writing the code I'm using SQL query so using system dot data dot SQL client so importing the SQL client how does that I am writing the query SQL connection con equal to new SQL connections so here I am writing the con uh, importing the connection string so just go to your database and click your database and right click and properties go to properties you will get the connection string here just double click and control C and here double quote inside double quote you have to just control V 
in doubt is there <coughs> okay local means is directly directed to your local database otherwise you know you want you know the your exact server name you have to mention server name my server name is vetrivel ipan pc otherwise just put local then you have to copy your software and uh, paste into any computer it will be uh, like uh, trigger in local server automatically otherwise you put the your server name then uh, it's difficult to you want to uh, paste in other computer then you want to you need need to change your server name here so i put local okay after that so co i am using select okay uh, in basically uh, by beginning purpose i am telling uh, two things one is sql data adapter other one is sql uh, command okay so i am sql data adapter uh, is here uh, fetching the data and is uh, this SQL data adapter also inserting data also is possible. So I am using SQL data adapter, SQL data adapter, SDA. Any names you have to put any name here. New SQL data adapter. Inside your data SQL data adapter, you need to paste your uh, code like SQL code. So sorry, uh, okay. And just I am going to new query and put class info and the student info I need some field only so I am selecting some field so I am executing the query is perfectly execute and just I am copy the code control C here just double click double code inside double code and just paste it so red code is error line because you writing the code in multi line you need to change in single line otherwise you just put inside before the double quote at symbol that's it okay at symbol is accepting multiple rows still the error code is there in sql data adapter because you not initialize your connection here so connection can con just put the comma and con so connection you importing the connection also now sql data adapter the ready to fetch the data so i need to one uh, data table then only we will get the result into data table okay so data sorry data table dt equal to new data table okay okay guys so uh, i uh, declare one data table here sda sql data adapter sda so sda dot fill dt so filled so just you have to uh, in beginning purpose i am put into debug mode and just i am running click show button the query will come here just press f10 f10 is step by step so you just go to connection connection initialized and sta sta is null so now press f10 one more time sta is now some query is there you go to select command here you, you have to see your query here this is your query okay so you successfully query passed now i one more time and press f10 and f10 so data will fetched now fetched into data table just go to data table here and go to the search option icon is that just click here you will see your data in data set visualization okay you can see your data so now our query is successfully executed okay now i uh, fetch into that uh, result uh, I, I want to insert the re data table result into data grid view okay just go, uh, go to designer and this is data grid view just i'm show button one more time click and uh, data grid view dot data source source equal to dt so that's it so you can run your programs and click show we will get 
one more thing you, you can see here class and academic year academic year is ACA underscore year admission number underscore admission underscore number is student underscore ID so like that the, your database field name directly comes into uh, your what uh, data grid view header so I want change some names here so then you can go and here this is class okay and just writing as class and here I'm using just as academic academic year so just control yes one more time you can run your programs and just show so we getting the error so because you are mentioning academic year inside some phase is there so the error will become so the, that that time you have to just put angle bracket here so just run it so you get class and academic year. you can change your header also same like you can do okay guys we will see next tutorial bye see you